Hello, this is Leo at Lee Time. In today's video, I want to show you how to make a delicious hydrosol from this herb. And this herb has been used to make a candy, calm down the sore throat, and improve the digestion. And it is Horhan. Through this video, I will have uh, three sessions. The first session to show you how to do the steam distillation by using our T3000. The second session explain the benefits of a horhorn based on its scientific study and its chemical compound composition. And the last, I will show you a recipe to make a, a candy from the horhorn hydrosol. In order to make your own hydrosol, you need a distiller and a herb and then you can start your distillation at home. This is organic horhorn. Um, it has a shredded uh, stem, leaf. I can even see the flowers. Press down can avoid the empty space, so reduce the escape the steam around the herb. I have added water in this pot. Filtered water is better. Now we turn on the heat. I'm doing the circulation for the condensation. When you set up the circulation, you need a bucket, a little aquarium pump, so the tubing, and this little valve is included in the package. So this can help adjust the flow rate. And go to the bottom of the uh, condenser and the water will come back from the top and go to the bucket. And also I having a little device, this is called a essential oil and a hydrosol separator. Even the whole horn has a very low oil content, but I still want to try to see if I can collect any uh, essential oil. When you set up this, you connect a tubing from the outlet on the condenser and then go down to the little oil uh, hydrosol separator. There was a customer asked, uh, do we need a, a thermometer for the distillation? When we distill the herbs to make hydrosol and essential oil, we don't actually need a thermometer because we want a boiling. We want to have uh, the highest temperature as possible because the heat in the steam can carry most of the volatile compounds and those are the essential compounds within the hydrosol and essential oil. When you are distilled alcohol, you're gonna need a thermometer to make sure you don't collect the methanol, the toxic methanol, which is uh, coming out at a lower temperature than the alcohol. So it keep you safe and make sure you only make uh, the alcohol. Let's take a look at the distillate. So actually we don't really get a much essential oil. There are a little bit. You see the little bubble or white layer. That is uh, the oil. This makes sense because the whole hog has a very low oil content. It's uh, about 0.2%. So that means when we are doing distillation with a one kilogram of the Horham plant, we can get a two milliliter, very few. Modern research studied the chemical composition of uh, Horham hydrosol. They found the mesoeugenol, vinalu, kaffir, eucalyptol, 
and methanol as a major compound. These chemicals are good antioxidants and also help anti-inflammation. Because of the chemicals within the hydrosol, there are top three uses. The first one is to help calm down the sore and relieve the coughing. You can add the hydrosol into a cold water or warm tea and mixing with the honey and the sugar. This will help you cool down the throat, reduce the coughing. What I like is a spray the hydrosol in the mouth, deep breathe the mist. This will help reduce the inflammation in the throat and also improve the bronchitis system. There was a study using the Horhorn hydrosol and essential oil, put on the apple and comparing without anything how long the apple can survive. It's very interesting, the Horhorn hydrosol can help the apples last a pretty long time and in the meantime, the apple without anything has already got a mold. Because the hydrosol has a good antifungal property, this keeps apple healthy during the storage. Horhorn hydrosol has a bitter flavor and a little bit like a smoky that can be used to add a flavor in the food including the ice cream and the liquor. And this also a good for the digestion system and relieve the constipation. At the end of the video, I will show you a simple recipe you can make a Horhorn plastic candy. Hopefully you learned something today. Like the video. Subscribe to the channel. See you next time.